hello and welcome to our channel so in this episode we are going to learn how to make smoothies for weight loss or uh, burn fat so as you may or may not know already depending if you are a regular follower on my blog and social media pages um the theme for this month is healthy juices aka juicy october so i thought i'd be it would be a nice way to kick off after the pandemic or amid the pandemic since the majority of the population would have uh, made a resolution sounding like this maybe work out get fit lose weight eat clean healthy etc um and yes this is uh, me every single new face of any outbreak of any disease and then uh, three months in so work out eat clean no way fries let me make this clear though clear though no i'm not on a, a juice diet detox whatever it's called i'm just exploring new ways i can enjoy fruit and vegetables combined as a post workout fresher when uh, i get home and i still sometimes eat like there is no tomorrow chicky green eh? so anyways yes it's already 10 p.m on a tuesday night and here i am still uh, doing this voice note for my video um so in this combination first one we will have um, a combination of orange plus ginger plus cucumber as uh, all helps to improve skin texture and the moisture and even reduces the body heat and weight in general so if you noticed on my recipe i did not uh, peel my my apples my cucumbers my carrots my beets and even ginger so you need to know that carrots nutrition is known to include vitamin a but these healthy vegetables contain other essential nutrients too uh, so peeling your carrots can affect their nutrition because different nutrients are found on different parts of a carrot and uh, they are healthiest and peeled you might wonder what about the the apple so according to the usda national nutrient database one medium that is three inch diameter and peeled apple has nearly double the fiber uh 25 percent more potassium and four 40 more vitamin a just to choose a few important nutrients so apple peels have further nutrition assets so you don't need to peel them actually and also ginger eating ginger peel won't harm you in any way it actually has a uh, a light gingery flavor and some nutritional value too so the only reason to peel your ginger is textual or rather the skin is a little tougher than the flesh but since ginger isn't usually eaten in big chunks there is simply no reason to peel ginger in most recipes so it has a great antioxidants it flushes out toxins and all and promotes hydration and can help mealy fluid needs as they are made of a uh, up to 96 percent water that is a cucumber sorry so they can help to aid in weight loss and may lower your blood sugar level so off you go the first combination is uh, of orange as i said ginger and the cucumber uh, it helps improve skin texture and moisture and even reduces the weight so many just assume that oranges contain high levels of vitamin c which strengthens uh, our immune responses yummy, yummy. of the body protecting us against recurring cold and cough or any other common infections but uh, that is basically not uh, just one of the many health benefits of single medium sized orange mm -hmm. so for example oranges also help prevent the aging of our skin which is uh, a form of vitamin a which uh, is from uh, yummy, yummy. the vitamin a present in the oranges that help to keep the skin membranes very healthy so it also contains a powerful antioxidant known as uh, beta carotene which um, protects the cells from being damaged other vitamins and minerals that can be found in oranges include vitamin b1 calcium copper even fiber potassium and yummy, yummy. much more so there are many proven health benefits of ginger too but in a nutshell ginger has a long history of use for levering digestive problems such as nausea loss of appetite motion sickness and pain and even weight loss in this episode so what i do 
find quite relevant though yeah, since yeah, yeah. I am getting back into my regular regime of uh, healthy drinks is that ginger has been shown to be effective against exercise and uh, losing weight as uh, also it helps uh, in uh, inducing muscle pain so ginger does not have uh, an immediate impact though but uh, may be effective yummy, at yummy. reducing the day-to-day -day progression of, uh, of muscle pain and such so in uh, the next recipe apart from this I'm going to cover in this uh, in this episode is about uh, this combination of uh, carrots. Yummy, yummy. Apart from carrots, I also have turmeric. I also have beetroot and uh, ginger also. So in this uh, rejuvenating root juice, carrot or beet, add orange, ginger, and turmeric juice. We will know how it this combo can help us in our weight loss journey. So you know that moment when the itch in the back of your throat that's been coming and going for days decides to set up camp and just that running nose you are sure was just allergies becomes an all out faucet. So this is the juice to turn to, and even if you want to lose the belly fat or general fat in your overall body so fresh bright and full of heat it comes to the rescue soothing sore throat easing congestion settling upset stomach and just general offering a welcome dose of energy so these are rejuvenating root juice of carrot beets oranges ginger and turmeric is the zippy juice with the power of uh, its ingredients put all together will put a little pep in your step so on those days when you neither have the energy or motivation to make anything proper to eat freshly pressed juice can go a long way in supplying much needed nutrients to your body so this particular one starts with the base of fruits and vegetables to which fresh ginger and turmeric root are added and is finished with a pinch of cayenne pepper that is optional though for that extra zig so it's the lingering heat of ginger and turmeric and the cayenne pepper if you opt to add that that help to numb those uh, scratchy throats and clear up those uh, sinuses while the orange and lemon supply the vitamin c and even detox your body so fresh turmeric with its earthy flavor pairs nicely with root vegetables like carrots and beets and offers its own inflammatory properties so to get most out of the turmeric you can add a little or rather a pinch of black pepper to the mix and uh, you can also add uh, uh, a squeeze of lemon if you choose to do so so a glass of this goes uh, down easy even when nothing else sounds good somehow soothing and fortifying at the same time but uh, it's also it may go to juice when i just need a little pick me up or extra energy so you tell me on the comment section what's your to go when you need a little extra pep in your step and also to lose some weight so in our recipe it can serve three people because of the their quantity so it depends on the quantity of the ingredients you choose to to you so i will do well to put the recipe on the description box so you can check on that later and uh, i wish you good health and uh, happy weight loss journey bye bye and I'll see you next in our next episode